Hey everyone, welcome to Data Millennials. I'm Atul and I'm super excited to talk about the string functions in SQL in this video. And we will start with the length function in this video. So let's go and see what exactly is this length function in SQL and how we can use it in our SQL queries. So the length function returns the length of a specific string and it's important to know that the length function does not include any trailing spaces at the end of a particular string when it starts calculating the length. So whenever you need to find out the length of a particular string in a particular column, then you can use this length function. So let's go and see how we can use it in a query. So we have this subscriber base table and if I run this, I have the whole detail of subscriber information. Now what I need to do is that I need to find out that how many characters are present in the first name of each and every subscriber. So what I can do is that I can simply write select subscriber id and then the first name the column of which we are going to calculate or find the length of that column so i'll write first name and then i'll put this length function len and post this length function you have to use bracket so in most of the sql the length function you can use len but in this sql workbench version i have to put the entire function which is length so i'll put length and within this bracket i need to put my column name which is first underscore name and i'll put the name of this column as length of first name and now if I run this, I'll get the subscriber ID, the first name and the length of the first name. So let's run it. So for the subscriber ID 1, the length is 7, while for subscriber ID 100, the name is Marin and the length is 5. So this is how basically you can use the length function to find out the length of a particular substring in a table. If you want to learn more about SQL, you can click on the right side of this video or if you are interested in excel you can click on the left side of this video happy learning and see you in the next video